find it already. Right. You best believe. Detective Ezio on the case. Portrait of a lady. Someone has broken into Sophia's shop and stolen a painting of considerable value. While she works, recover the painting. Full sync if I steal the painting without the merchant spotting me. Identifying the painting's thief inside the bazaar. There was a window I could come through here. I know about these ones, but I thought there was another one. There is a man with a suspicious look. Where is it, Ladro? Confess! I have done nothing. I, I do not know. need to. What are you doing? I will just keep hitting you until you talk. I found them. I mean, someone give it. Get your story straight before you lie to my face. Do not care how you got the painting. Just tell me where it is. I sold it to a, a merchant in the bazaar. How else will I feed myself? Next time, find a nicer way to be a canalia. <laughs> Love it. All right, so we gotta find the merchant who bought the painting. Yeah, no, for some reason, Ezio just started punching, like, towards that woman that was just walking by. I have a painting for sale, if you are curious. A luminous portrait. You see how lifelike she looks. Her beauty shines through. Distraction methods, huh? Let me talk to my friend here. The only one that would help me here is the cherry bomb. Fuck, man. I thought the cherry bomb would do a little bit more than, like, what it did. <laughs> I mean, this guy has some better than this. None of those are good. They're all You'll be not something I need. I need either a smoke bomb or some something that would do the drop of thunder. Confess! I have done nothing. You cannot do this. I do not need to. I will just keep hitting you until you talk. I found that. Try to throw money, but I don't think that's gonna work. I have a painting for sale. If you are curious, a loom. I'm an idiot. I thought interact was gonna talk to him, not fucking. Last time I restarted. Like the 
hardest mission in the game. It hurt someone. One sleep. There is a man with a suspicious look. Where is it, Ladro? Confess! I have that man. You cannot do it that. I do not need to. I will just keep hitting you until you talk. I found that. I mean... Do have the stink bomb. <laughs> Let me try what I was thinking first, though. What are you doing? I am not What I should have did originally I was just run up and throw a coin at him. Please, don't hurt me. It is a good likeness, don't you think? I prefer the original. <laughs> Buffone. This was a gift from my father for my 28th birthday. I had to sit for Messer Albrecht Durer for a full week. Can you imagine me sitting still for seven days, doing nothing? I cannot. Una tortura. <laughs> so, I found you another book location. And it is not far from here, actually. Grazie. Ezio, what is this all about? You are not a scholar, that much is clear. Do you work for the church? <laughs> not the church, no. But I am a teacher, of a kind. I will explain one day, Sophia, when I can. One day, but not right now. All right, so let's head towards the next book. The horse is on the top of the colony. It's on top of the colony. It's on top of the column. What I was trying to say. I was readying my hook blade. That was a crazy grab, actually. Signs and Symbols Part 2. Niccolo Polo had hit a book near the Valens Aqueduct containing clues to Miss Yef Key's location. Use the Polo symbols to reveal it. Oh. I wonder if there. Again, it can't be on a wall, so. 
There's no... It's not going to save me a whole hell of a lot of time to fly over there anyways. Head over there now to the next. Uh, I don't want to say it, it's a crypt, the next dungeon, I guess. It's not really a tomb either. I don't know the proper way to put it. Secret location, how about that? What did you find? Another key? Door of some kind, bricked up with hard stone. Ah, promising. The first key was found behind a similar door. Timulus. And how did they open that door? They did it. The earthquake did. Iberoja. All we have are a few barrels of gunpowder. This should do. And if it does not, we get more. Diablo! The assassin! Go! Go! That's really unfortunate. The form of the ox. The clue left behind by the polos has brought Ezio to the form of the ox. Unfortunately, the Templars are searching here too. Full sync if I do not take any damage. That's kind of baloney, isn't it? You will not leave here alive! And also, falling into the rapid will cause a desync, so... Good to know. Probably be focused up for this now. I almost missed that joke. I was a little unsure about that one, but I almost fell there. He's behind us! 
Too far right to jump on this. Lame. How to do that? Thank you, though. Assassin. Show yourself. Con dos te con bastardo. We should use it! Stand back! Give me some room! Three treasure chests here. One, two, and the one behind me. They're like actual. That are like actual treasure chests as I unplugged my mic. Jesus. Alright, and then I'm looking for a secret. Altair memory.
Man, they took away all my parachutes again. That's why. Uh, that's how I keep losing my parachutes. Is they fucking keep taking them away when I go into the secret locations. Which I guess makes sense, or else you could break it. Like, break the game, but still. You think they would give them back at the end of the level? have been taking their archive on Cyprus. Abbas sent no reinforcements. It was a massacre. Oh my God. Maria, when we left myself ten years ago, this order was strong. But all our progress has been undone. Abbas must answer for this. Answer to whom? The assassins obey only his command now. Resist your desire for revenge, Altair. Speak truth, and they will see their error. He executed our youngest son, Maria. He deserves to die. Perhaps. But if you cannot win back the order by honorable means, its foundation will crumble. You are right. Thirty years ago, I let passion overtake my reason. And it caused a rift that has never fully healed. Well, the one thing I'm going to say right now is I noticed it at other parts, but I definitely noticed it there. Um, the music is way too loud. It's only at two. Sound effects only at two. Voices at six. The game is way too loud. And reasonable men will listen. Some will, but not Abbas. I should have expelled him 30 years ago when he tried to steal the apple. But you earn the respect of the other assassins because you let him stay. How do you know this? You were not there. I married a masterful storyteller. Look at this place. Masyaf is a shadow of its former self. We have been away for a long time. But not in hiding. The Mongol threat demanded our attention and we rode to meet it. What man here can say the same? Where is our eldest son? Does Darim know his brother is dead? I sent him a message four days ago. With luck, it has reached him already. Abbas, I almost pity him. He wears his grudge like a cloak. His wound is deep. It will help him to hear the truth. As I walk these streets, I sense a great fear in the people. Not love. Abbas has dismantled this place and robbed it of all joy. We may be walking to our doom, Maria. We may, but we walk together. Let them speak. We seek the truth about our son's death. Why was Seth killed? Is it the truth you want? Or an excuse for revenge. If the truth gives us an excuse, we will act on it. Surrender the apple, Altair, and I will tell you why your son was put to death. Ah, the truth is out already. Abbas wants the apple for himself, not to open your minds, but to control them. You have held that artifact for 30 years, Altair, reveling in its power and hoarding its secrets. It has corrupted you. Very well, Abbas. Take it. What? Before I executed your son, I told him you ordered it yourself. He died, believing you had betrayed him. Tyre! No! 
Strength, Altair. Maria. He is possessed! Kill him! Take the apple! No! All right, let's get the fuck out of here then. <laughs> Father, I got your message. What has happened? That him! Turn back! Have they all gone mad? We have to go. Abbas must not get his hands on the apple. If you need more knives, take them. Above you! Alright, we have a couple things to show here, so I might as well show them. So Dirim and Seth, which are the sons of Altair and Maria, obviously, as we've come to learn. And then also, we had a database entry for Murray as well. Reason, Darim. They've been poisoned by lies. Later. First, we fight. We must leave at once! But what the fuck, man? Every, like, two seconds, he's running a different way and telling me, like... Watch out! That I'm either too far or not far enough. Let them catch us! Was it Abbas who killed my brother? He killed your brother, Malik, and countless others. He is a madman. A madman with an army. He will die. One day he will pay. Full sink, anyways. <clears throat> okay, there was no full sink. It is time to go. I am not was it the boss who killed my brother? I will have the apple out there. 
and I will have your head for all the dishonor he brought upon my family. You cannot run forever, not from us, and not from your lies. time a little bit there, but that's all right. Through anger and betrayal, Altair lost those closest to him. And yet he carried on. I have never felt pain so severe. Perhaps because my heart is too hard to risk the joys of real love. Well, with that little outro there, uh, that's going to be the end of the recording session. I'm over on time. When we come back, we will continue with the memory start. I um, don't really remember what we're doing. Oh, yes, the bazaar. We're going to the bazaar to keep an eye on uh, the Genesaries and Tariq, I believe his name was. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and say, comment down below, subscribe, share. So, I'll you know. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.